Take back the lion. Meh. I feel like there was a glitch related this to this lady in the keep, but I don't remember. Let's just hope I didn't fuck anything up. How about that, eh? Hmm. Uh, I guess I could go click on the bridge over here. Actually, let's just put a fucking marker on it, too. Actually, no. I'll mark that one. I'm not gonna get, lose track of the bridge. Well, I guess especially not if the marker didn't go away. So anyway, mod updates. Uh, I made my companion mod compatible with uh, the Mothership Zeta DLC. Um, I was pretty proud of that. I still need to test it, though. Um, I actually just beat uh, a Fallout 3 playthrough the other day, or was it yesterday? I, I, I don't know. Days are a fucking blur for me. The other day, I got out of bed at like 4 p.m., right? And then, you know, it was like... then. I don't know if it was the next day or if it was the same day, but I just I just don't know what day it is sometimes. Losing my fucking mind. <sighs> but anyway, why the fuck was I talking about that? I, I don't know. Uh but yeah, I made the mod I made the companion compatible with uh Mothership Zeta, which could be exciting. I like I made a thing where you know, when you get captured by the fucking aliens... Oh, I gotta go up there, don't I? When you get captured by the aliens, you know, you won't see anything different right away. Um, like, if you were to, like, turn around and walk into the zone and get abducted that way, you know, like, you'll still see the companion standing there until, you, of course, you get too high or whatever. And then you'll be in the probing chair. Um, I actually had to make a condi... I, I actually had to modify some things... So that the companion would not teleport in that room with you, because <laughs> uh, I I set a I set up a script right that would make it so if the companion's not in the same cell as you and you are in an interior cell, then they would just teleport like to your cell as if they came in with you. Uh, I and I and I made an interior cell. Oh, I already. Oh, I already fixed the bridge. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Um, yeah, completed. I didn't even fucking look at it. Uh, whatever. I don't care about that right now. Um, I, yeah. There's like no fucking camp over there or whatever. That is so gay and retarded. Literally. Um, you have to make that trek every time. So if you get your butt kicked by I don't know any of the three dragons over here or any of the fade things, then you got to go back to camp and make the journey again. Have fun, boss. Have fun. Hmm. Uh, so yeah, made that script to so where they uh, go to you when you're in interior cells. Um, I did not do outer cells for a reason, because then when you're just walking outside in the wasteland, you know, even if they're like six feet away from you, um, you know, you you'll be going in and out of cells all fucking game outside. You may not know where they begin. Oh gosh. Um, but you're going, you would random, you would randomly see the companion just start teleporting to you r r in random circumstances, and that's just kind of jarring and weird looking. So I got that the fuck out of there and put the uh, interior cell thing in place. Um, and then I just simply added some, uh, restrictions. Oh no, really? Oh, I forgot about this invisible wall. Oh well, doesn't matter, I can go around. I had to set some restrictions uh, in my if-then statement. Um, basically, uh, certain areas where you're not supposed to have someone, boom, I put it in there, and it shouldn't teleport them to you. However, I don't, like, if they're already following you, I don't know how the game takes care of that sort of thing like there are some cells that just simply don't bring followers with you when you enter them which is fine like for example in Zeta you know you have the fucking spacewalk you're in space 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 villagers oh out of seven ah oh, shit I thought I did this but already fucking balls although just looking at the map I should have known that I haven't done that by now because I'm an idiot um so anyway, yeah, don't want the companion out in the spacewalk. That doesn't make any damn sense. They don't have a spacesuit. Why the fuck would they be out there? So I would I would have to assume that there's just something... Where are you going, Sarah? You know there's, like, 
a guy here. In fact, a couple guys here just already fighting us. There's no reason to run away to other people, you fuck. But, you know, whatever. <clears throat> so anyway, yeah, I don't, you know, I assume there's something in place to make, you know, companions not walk into certain rooms, such as the spacewalk or the depressurization zone or whatever you want to call it. Um... Because, you know, you, there are companions in Zeta. You know, the fucking cowboy, Paulson, the Elliot guy, Soma, what have you. And they they certainly don't go in with you. So I would like to hope that other companions don't go in there automatically either. So, of course, I have to add that, you know, to the restricted stuff. Um, so they don't just teleport in there. Oh, I have to help you, huh? You're lucky I'm a nice guy. I'm a real nice guy, but we're done professionally. Ah! It was good to do that. Yeah, it was. <clears throat> and anyway, back to the Fallout DLC stuff. Uh, I still need to play test through the game again. I don't know when I'm going to start another character, though, in Fallout 3. Because I need to do that to test the fucking character. Like, uh, I have this one character mod that I downloaded. Oh, wow, it's not a locked door. And it's like... Well, hold on. Uh, work orders. The boys at Suladine need several barrels for those things they are working on. Also, prepare a batch for the Storm Coast. Fournier. <gasps> oh? <gasps> oh. <gasps> a bottle of fanners! Legacy white sheer, peculiar and rare. Peculiar and rare. A single run of this spirit took color in what has been optimistically been called a flavor from lyrium in the cask spilge hoop. A slipping whiskey if you value your innards. Circa 79 TE. Mm, I don't know what TE stands for. Uh, so what the fuck was I saying? Uh, my mod. What about my mod? Damn it! Damn it! It's a slip my mind! That fucking sucks. What is this? What's in the box? A belt of electric resistance! Who done thunked it? What a piece of crap. Hmm. So yeah, I need to play through the game and test it. Uh, oh yeah, there was a mod I downloaded. Before I need to also, I also need to restart my recording soon. There's this one companion mod I installed, right, where you have this, like, sister in the vault. Which is fine and dandy, I suppose. However, it doesn't really seem like it was play-tested, or at least play-tested to the amount that I would expect it to be. Because, uh, I just, you know, randomly stumbled upon, like, weird issues. Where's that fucking spot? It's, like, behind a tree, I think. Maybe it's by the sleeping stuff over here. Uh, letters home, Dell. It's over. It's done. I got him. I'm coming back to my old camp to pick up the letter I left for you. And then I'm leaving this horrible place. I don't have to skulk around anymore, hiding behind trees and erasing my tracks. I'm free and I'm coming home. Diane. Okay. Uh... What's this? Villagers freed? Uh... Well, I guess so. Uh... A lot of crap over here. Just a whole lot of nonsense. So anyway, this one that mod I installed, it's like, you know, they didn't they didn't apply fail states to a quest uh, if you were to accidentally fucking miss it. So it'd just be permanently in your quest log no matter what. Um, and there were just some random glitches, odds and ends, that sort of thing. Um, so yeah, I am play testing the poopy pants out of my mod. You good yet, Cassandra? Can you tell me what she was like? Who? Oh, the Divine. Yes, I'm sorry. I'm not used to such unorthodox displays of faith. Most Holy was a visionary. I served as her right hand, and would have done so as long as she needed me. But you didn't know her. I just said, I served as her right hand. Fine, whatever. I'll ask Leliana. You can tell there was something with those two. Family pain there. Hmm. Yeah, I guess Sarah doesn't know that. The Divine basically uh, got Liliana out of her shit back in before Origins. What the fuck? Spooky bats? Get out of here, Zubat, you fuck. 
or whatever your dumb name is. So, anyway, if this is the spot I think it is, there are some goodies coming up. Prowler coat, some white shitty items. <clears throat> so, anyway, oh yeah, I gotta remember... This is the spot, right? This does not look familiar. Oh, but that does. Okay. Now, here's, here's some story, Mark. Um, like, I was looking for this thing, and I stumbled upon something magnificent. Like, I was like, well, 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 where is the thingy, Bob? So it's like, I figured, oh, maybe it's over, maybe, the, maybe the, the rune I need is right there. So, you know, it's like, oh, I jump, I jump, I jump. Damn it! Stop! Don't fall off, you fuck. Remember the first time I did it? Oh! Oh, my God! And I thought this was, like, the weirdest glitch ever. Turns out it's not actually a glitch. It's meant to be hidden. So you remember that one thing I did in... What was it called? The Emerald Graves? I jumped on a rock a bit. I jumped on a rock. And then a, a, there was a spooky voice talking. And then I gave it flowers. Uh, well, I guess after doing that, this is where the thing is. Um, but yeah, I just stumbled on this on ac by accident. Uh, a long time ago. Uh, did not know at the time what its intention was. Let's see, where the fuck? Oh, there it is. For a second, I was worried the box this didn't spawn it. in. This is it. Take it. Use it. I'm going laughing all the way. Okay. Gold armor rating. Plus 24% sunder when hit. Is this... What is this? Like a flower hat? Are you kidding me, bro? I've always wanted one of those! Uh... Elf, dwarf, or human. Which is pretty fucking stupid, but... Uh... Level 19! Are you kidding me, bro? I need to be a certain level to put flowers on my head? I don't want to live in this world anymore. Gee. What a disgusting world we live in. Um, unbelievable. It's just unbelievable. Uh. So anyway, I guess I will see you guys when I get out of here and look for the rune and then we'll continue talking about my mod stuff.